You are all listening to <laughs> Crazy Radio. Crazy Radio. Good evening, messy gang gang. What's poppin' everybody? It's your girl Drizzy. Welcome back to Drizzy Radio. Get a cup of tea, let's jump straight into this mess. But first of all, if you're new here and you want to join the messy gang, kindly hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bells that you know wherever we upload. We're shady or messy, a little bit nosy. Let's get into some things. Let's do what to do good. Of course, that is being messy, being nosy, and being a little bit shady, you guys. So it so happened that miss zarina hassan finally decided to reply after being dragged for days for the comments that she made on her instagram stories you guys you all know that not too long ago zara's boss lady came out and said that if you have a chance to cheat for a car a land or a property kindly do it because these guys are here be cheating on a big nyash a lady with a tongue ring or a light-skinned lady some agreed with her but most of people were dragging her saying is that the same thing we did that we did with the ramadam on platinums because you can't be here preaching water and then drinking wine on the wine on the low low diamond cheated on you the entire relationship uh, but you're out here telling us that if the guys cheat on you you should cheat back but cheat it big anyway let's listen to her explanation into why she said whatever it is that she said because i still felt like miss mamas could have just shut up okay the things that she was saying weren't making any sense she was contradicting herself even more i don't believe she even meant what she said anyway let's listen to it you know and kind of you misunderstood me yani hamu kunielewa kabisa sijatuma wanawake wenu waende kuchiki wala sijawatuma nimesema let me interpret it majirani vingeleza najua vinawasumbua imesema wanaume akikutwa na chiki juu ya matako makubwa vitu venye havina tafaida wewe umeweka kwenye chance ya kuchiki upewe gari upewe nyumba cheti why not hmm? it's 2023 jamani women are not sleeping wewe una cheat juu ya matako makubwa kwa nini nisicheat nipewe nyumba mwanangu hi we are awake <laughs> you are like when i'm when you wanna cheat okay we want you guys to be supportive we're always supportive of you we understand we're there for you you know we forgive So when you get your women cheating can you give the same support back be understanding forgive stick by them because that's women are that's what women are doing when me kutwa to i don't cheat you know, i love being with my person until things don't work out and then to our china and i move on but for the cheating ones brothers have the same spirits your women are giving you stick with them stand by them forgive hmm? same energy Okay you guys uh, for one I understand that most of TZ people don't understand English but the way she put it is uh, it was a little bit disrespectful this is something that she has done so many times you guys uh, she was talking about oh I know our neighbors don't understand the English but uh, honey not all of them don't understand the English there's so many educated Tanzania out there who speak way good english than yours miss mamas they're well articulate they're very very educated doesn't mean that if somebody don't know english they're not smart okay but anyway she decided to say to my non swahili listeners all to my swahilians like i call them uh that the real reason why she say that is because you can't be with a guy if a guy cheat on you because you know she cheat on you with somebody who has you know like a tongue ring or like a big nyash if you have a chance to cheat on him with somebody that will give you a car you should just cheat on him because if you you are able to forgive your boyfriend even if they cheated on you with a lady that look a certain way why won't they not cheat on you why would they not why would they not forgive you since you forgive them they she said in her words forgiveness forgiveness goes goes both ways but i was just wondering is that the same thing that happened since you're out here telling us oh cheat if somebody cheat on you or it's something that just popped up ever since you started dating your new man anyway i want to hear what you have to say about uh, don't look at this question because at this point i'm asking myself so many questions keep it classy same as let's chop it down love it to the moon